What's up YouTube, it's Ariel Soria Fitness here and today I'm going to be making a video about what is in my gym bag at the current moment. So let's get started. So this is my gym bag right here. It is by Inaka by Charlie Coker and this is their logo right here in case you guys are interested. It's called Inaka Power. And personally, what I personally like to have in my gym bag is everything that I may need whenever I'm doing my workouts or any accessory work or anything like that. So the first thing that I'm going to go ahead and show you guys is my custom lifting belt, which I got it a couple years ago. And it's personally my favorite thing that I have in my gym bag because it represents the logo, it represents everything that is a YouTube channel and my brand, Ariel Osorio Fitness. So, this is my lifting belt. And this is a design that I got here. So, when I made this one, I personally had not begun Ariel Osorio Fitness because if not, I definitely would have included the fitness section, but you get the gist of everything. It's essentially right here. And some of the things that you can do with this belt is if you're having low back pain or anything like that, you can go ahead and put this on so that it gives you extra support. The times that I use this the most is when I'm doing squats or deadlifts or things like that because when I'm doing deadlifts, I tend to have pain if I don't use a belt so in my back. So this is just a great essential and an overall need when I'm doing leg day or anything where I need extra back support. Number one. The second thing is, in terms of when I'm working on my upper back, my favorite back exercise that I like to do is weighted chin-ups or weighted pull-ups. It's just either you're doing it like this or you're grabbing on it on the, on the handle like this. Which, right here, this is the one that I use by Kino Body, Greg O'Gallagher. And the way that you put this on, let me show you guys. So the way that you put this on, whenever I'm wearing this, I always feel like Batman. So you put this on right here, you adjust it, and then you would put place here. For the sake of the video, I don't have any right here where I'm filming, but I'm just gonna pretend that I have a plate right here. So you would put this through the hole of the plate, and then it would slide right here, and then you would Hook it on to this, the plate would be hanging on here, so adjust it to your fitting, and then go ahead and do your workouts. So, it's doing your own body weight plus added weight, which gives you a really strong and formed back. Very, very essential for, for upper back day. Or, if you're doing weighted dips, same thing, you can do this, and this is how it looks. Right here. So, that's the next thing that I like to focus on. So that's the next thing. The other thing that I have in my bag, because I don't like having to look for, I'm gonna go ahead and call them lifting clamps, lifting, you'll, 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 you'll know what I'm talking about. I'll just have the name on the screen right here because I'm not sure what exactly you call these. I like to have my own of these because I hate having to look for a pair of these whenever I'm doing squats, bench press, incline bench press, deadlifts, or anything with the barbell. I like to have my own, that way I don't have to be squirming around, wasting time in the gym. I'd like to be quick, efficient, and productive in the gym and outside of the gym. So this is an absolute essential for me. And of course, since blue is my favorite color, why not? I just wish this could have been gold. That would have been cool. And the next essential that I personally like to use, whenever I'm doing heavy, heavy deadlifts, I, have, I tend to have sweaty hands. So I tend to lose my grip. And so what I tend to use are the Harbinger lifting straps, which allow me to put it around my wrist. You, you fix it, you put it around the barbell, and then grab on to the barbell. That way, once it's rolled up like this, you essentially grab it like this, and you, it'll help you not lose your grip. So I put one on each hand. I just take off my Apple Watch when I'm doing this, and you will not have a problem with your grip when you're doing heavy, heavy deadlifts, whether that's sumo, Romanian, strict, anything like that, these are essential. And the other one is 
right over here. So one for each hand, of course. The other one that I like to use when I'm going heavy on bench press or dumbbell bench press or anything of that variation for my wrist, I haven't used these in a long time because I have been working on exercises that help strengthen my wrist, like, like Zotman curls where you grab a dumbbell in each hand and you just do this. That's reverse curl and then Zotman curls is doing like this. So it helps strengthen my wrist. So I have not used these in a while, but in case I do need them and I feel like I'm gonna go ahead and probably injure my wrist or if I'm going heavy on dips, like I said a moment ago, I personally go ahead and use these rogue wrist straps, which the way that you use, I'm just gonna go ahead and put one on so that you get the gist of things. The way that you do this is you wrap it around your thumb, put it like this, keep going, and then right here is where it stays with the Velcro. And then this allows your hand, this makes your hand not move in any type of direction, whether that's like this, kind of like for feet, like dorsiflexion, things like that. So it allows you to stay stagnant and won't make your wrist hurt in any type of way or form or fashion. So for anyone that does tend to have wrist pain or anything of that sort, highly, highly recommend it. The Rogue brand, very good. And last but not least, the other thing that I like to have, let me just go ahead and put this all away, guys. Fast forward. And now, my other essential, give me one second. Let me just go ahead and grab it right here. My other essential that I like to use for, for the gym is my blender bottle right here. What I like about this is that it is insulated. As you see here, the inside of it is insulated. So when you close it, whether you're drinking your BCAs, protein powder, water, like I have here, and you close it, it stays cool and nice. Whether you're outside in the cold, in the heat, or anything like that, can't go wrong with this. And my favorite feature about this, because in terms of organizing and things like that, I'm a neat freak. I like everything to be clean and tidy so what i love about this that ensures me that this whatever i have in my blender bottle stays in it and i don't risk dropping something in my car is that you can lock it right here and yes unlock right now you technically won't drop anything but i like to be 100 percent sure meaning that i lock it here when i'm shaking it and i can guarantee you that nothing will fall wherever you are right here so i could drop it right here nothing and then when you're about to drink, you just unlock it, open it, and sip. And then in terms of showing you guys a little bit about my gym bag, like I mentioned a moment ago, this is the Naka Power brand. I'll be honest, this bag is super, super essential. It has everything that I might need and everything. So. Let me show you guys a little about how it looks. So, right here, I personally, you can, if you have a locker where you want to put things, I personally have this right here, where where you can put there. I have my keys right here. This right here. Adjustable for your water. So as you see here, fits perfectly. Locks twice. That way you ensure that nothing falls in and out. You can grab it like this, you can grab it through these. And also has two pockets right here. So if you have any extra things that you've got to put away, a little water bottle right here or anything that you want to put, perfect for the side pockets. And honestly guys, as you see right here, it has a little padding so that it doesn't hurt your back. And this is how I like to carry it. So when I'm coming to the gym, this is how I like to carry it. And honestly guys, I don't know what I would do without my gym bag because I use it every single day that I come to the gym and lift. Obviously, if I'm doing just cardio, I don't need it besides this, but it, it comes very in handy when I'm gonna go ahead and come to the gym for lifting, PRs, things of that nature. So yeah, I think that rounds the video up. If you have any questions or comments about why I have certain things, anything that I should include in my gym bag or anything like that, comment down below let me know 
if you have any questions let me know as well I'm always checking to see if there's any interaction because I like interacting with my viewers so thank you guys for watching Aerial Sorio Fitness here signing out thank you